Hey there, lovely viewers. Welcome back to Mind Body Soul, your go-to channel for all things related to health, wellness, and science. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, share this video, and drop a comment below with your thoughts and questions. Today, we're diving deep into a topic that affects millions of people worldwide. The science behind cholesterol, myths versus facts. Cholesterol is a hot topic in the world of health, and it's surrounded by its fair share of myths and misconceptions. But fear not, we're here to unravel the science behind cholesterol and separate fact from fiction. Myth 1. All cholesterol is bad. Myth number 1. All cholesterol is bad for you. This couldn't be further from the truth. Cholesterol is essential for our bodies, and it serves various critical functions. Our bodies produce cholesterol naturally, mainly in the liver, and it's vital for the production of cell membranes, hormones like cortisol and testosterone, and even vitamin D without cholesterol, our bodies couldn't function properly. Fact 1. Good versus bad cholesterol. Fact number 1. There's good cholesterol and bad cholesterol. High-density lipoprotein, HDL, is often referred to as good cholesterol because it helps remove excess cholesterol from the bloodstream, reducing the risk of plaque buildup in your arteries. On the other hand, low-density lipoprotein, LDL, is often called bad cholesterol because elevated LDL levels can lead to plaque formation in your arteries, increasing the risk of heart disease. Myth 2. Eating cholesterol-rich foods raises your cholesterol. Myth number 2. Eating cholesterol-rich foods, like eggs and shrimp, raises your cholesterol levels. This myth has caused many people to avoid these nutritious foods unnecessarily. The truth is that for most people, dietary cholesterol has a minimal impact on their blood cholesterol levels. Our bodies tightly regulate cholesterol, and when we consume more cholesterol from food, our liver typically produces less to compensate. Fact 2. Focus on saturated and trans fats. Fact number 2. When it comes to heart health, it's more important to focus on reducing saturated and trans fats in your diet than worrying about dietary cholesterol. Saturated and trans fats can raise your LDL cholesterol levels, increasing your risk of heart disease. So, instead of obsessing over cholesterol-rich foods, pay attention to the types of fats you consume. Myth 3. Lowering cholesterol always equals better health. Myth number 3. Lowering your cholesterol to extremely low levels is always better for your health. While it's essential to manage your cholesterol levels, there's such a thing as going too low. Cholesterol is crucial for brain health and hormone production, and excessively low levels can have adverse effects on your well-being. Fact 3. Focus on overall heart health. Fact number 3. Instead of obsessing solely over cholesterol levels, focus on overall heart health. Factors like regular exercise, a balanced diet rich in fruits and vegetables, maintaining a healthy weight, and not smoking are equally, if not more, important in reducing your risk of heart disease. We've covered some essential points about cholesterol, but there's more to come. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and share this video with your friends and family. And if you have any questions or want to share your own experiences, drop a comment below. Now, let's get back to debunking those cholesterol myths. Myth 4. Medication is the only solution. Myth number 4. Medication is the only solution for managing high cholesterol. While cholesterol-lowering medications can be beneficial, they're not the only option. Lifestyle changes like improving your diet, increasing physical activity, and reducing stress can have a significant impact on your cholesterol levels and overall heart health. Fact 4. Medication as a tool. Fact number 4. Cholesterol-lowering medications can be a helpful tool for those at high risk of heart disease, but they should be used in conjunction with lifestyle changes, not as a replacement. Always consult with your healthcare provider to determine the best approach for managing your cholesterol. Myth 5. It's only about diet. Myth number 5. It's all about diet when it comes to managing cholesterol. While diet plays a crucial role, there's more to the story. Genetics, family history, and other factors also influence your cholesterol levels. Some individuals may have genetically high cholesterol, making it more challenging to manage through diet alone. Fact 5. Genetics matter. Fact number 5. Genetics can significantly impact your cholesterol levels. 
If you have a family history of high cholesterol or heart disease, it's essential to be proactive about monitoring and managing your cholesterol. Myth 6. Cholesterol testing is unnecessary. Myth number 6. Cholesterol testing is unnecessary, especially if you're young and healthy. This misconception can be dangerous because high cholesterol can often be asymptomatic. Regular cholesterol testing, starting in your 20s, can help identify any issues early on and allow for proactive management. Fact 6. Regular screening is key. Fact number 6. Regular cholesterol screening is key to maintaining heart health. It's a simple blood test that can provide valuable information about your risk of heart disease. We've busted some common cholesterol myths today, but there's always more to learn. Before we wrap up, please remember to subscribe, like this video, share it with your loved ones, and leave your comments down below. Your engagement helps our channel grow and reach more people with vital health information. And here's a treat for you. If you're interested in maintaining cardiovascular wellness, check out our video on 10 daily routines for cardiovascular wellness. I'll give you a moment to click on it and discover some fantastic tips for a healthy heart. Thank you for joining us today on Mind Body Soul as we tackled the myths and facts surrounding cholesterol. Remember that knowledge is power when it comes to your health, so stay informed, make healthy choices, and consult with your healthcare provider for personalized advice. Until next time, take care of your mind, body, and soul. Bye for now.